this video we are looking at the lock picking mechanics of this game to try and explain it to people who may not have seen a lock picking system like this and it is a relatively different unique lock picking system so i'm going to try my best to try and explain to you the idea of it the concept of it and how it works but before we get into it make sure you hit that like button subscribe if you're new around here for more starfield content and let me know what you're thinking about the game let me know if you found any cool little things that i should make a video on down below in the comments section the pit locking in this game is a multi-phase experience where you have to do the same thing multiple times in different ways i will say i am not entirely sure how the perks that help with cracking safes and lock picking and stuff how it affects this mini game i don't know whether it'll make it make you do less phases or just have easier patterns i can't tell you that off the bat but it will definitely make it easier than it already is and it's fairly simple it's just a little bit complex looking let's get into it all right so this is the general ui of a lock picking system you're going to see me fail at this one specifically and then have to bring it back and use a different pattern you'll see coming up but i want to talk about the kind of brief idea of what is happening so we've got the security level here which will tell you how difficult it will be i believe the higher the level the more times you'll have to put a key which is one of these into this pattern every time you enter a key into this outer circle it will change the amount of holes that are in cut into the circle right this outside one so the next one might only have two of these instead of five which is here then you do that multiple times until you get to the inner circle and then you will finally unlock the pad lock and you will see that coming up in a second down here with the auto slot this is part of a perk package i believe where once you upgrade it you can have more auto slots so i think you can have eight in total and i believe if you just press y once or something it will either automatically unlock the outside one or just automatically unlock it altogether. you have the amount of digi picks that you have here i believe it's one digi pick per attempt so if you mess it up and then you have to undo it you lose one digi pick and you have to use another one you'll see that coming up too so these patterns here are essentially your keys that you are entering into this lock as you can see this one is highlighted which means these three lines are these three here now you have to line up these with a gap and if you line all three of them up with all three gaps then you can press the button and it will change the pattern to the next lock and then you can choose a new key to be able to then open that lock so this might go down to just one one space with everything else locked up and you need to find a key that only has one line on it if it has two lines on it even though you can line up one of them the other one won't line up to anything that's the mistake i made then i realized i had to go back and redo it and choose a different key for the pattern that i'd previously done it will make sense as you watch it but essentially this outer layer here is the lock these are the keys you have to line up the lines with the gaps multiple times until you get to the inner lock and then you'll be able to just open the lock completely and get what's inside and that is the best explanation i can give off lock picking to you guys i hope that it helped again like button subscribe all of that wonderful youtube stuff thank you for your continued support on all these starfield videos this game's incredible i can't wait for mods to come out because i think there's going to be some fun videos there let me know what you're thinking down below thank you for watching i've been easy now you guys have been awesome